Welcome to Austin Hardware. I'm Steve Klein, Fastener Specialist, and today I'd like to talk to you a little bit about blind threaded inserts. One of the things that you'll find when talking about blind threaded inserts is that there's very many names out in the industry. You may hear terms like rivet nut, riv nut, nut cert, thin sheet nut cert. Those are all blind threaded inserts. They're all different styles of blind threaded inserts. And just to give you an idea of how many different ones there are, this is a little Atlas demo plate that I have, and you can see all the various different styles depending on the type of application that you have. The style of insert I have here with me today is called an Atlas Spin Tight. It's a very, very common blind threaded insert. These are available in thread sizes from 440 up to 3816. This is a insert that is made in a progressive stamping machine. Thus, you have a fairly thin wall to it, which makes it ideal for a lot of different types of application. You don't need a very powerful tool to install them. What you will typically use, and this is an Atlas 800 series air tool. These are called spin-spin tools because they work by spinning the insert up until it reaches its collapse load and then reversing and spinning out again. Many industries use blind threaded inserts when they're making products that have materials that are too thin to support a tapped hole or permanent load bearing thread. Thus, you will install one of these types of inserts. They're also used in, in, in industries where you can't get to the back side of an application. Think of a square tube where you can't access both sides where using a nut and a bolt is impractical. Lastly, when discussing blind threaded inserts, the term blind means one-sided installed. You don't need to get to the back side. A blind threaded insert is going to pull up very similarly to a blind rivet in that you get a backside bearing surface that will prevent it from pulling through the material. And also, too, you can use a blind threaded insert almost like a rivet, where if you want to put two pieces of material together and hold them together, but also have a pathway to attach something else to it via a threaded fastener, this type of insert allows you to do that. Like I stated earlier, there's many different variations of these types of blind threaded inserts. There's ones that are designed to be used in softer material like plastics. There are others that are designed uh, for very high strength applications. Thank you very much.